What do you know about Estonian food? For most people, the answer is not a lot. But the Baltic nation's food scene is seeing something of a renaissance, led by innovative young chefs and restaurateurs who are finding exciting new ways to put Estonian cuisine on the map. In this episode of Discover Estonia, we're going on a culinary journey. Let's go. Estonian cuisine is hard to define, even for many Estonians. Historically, it's been based on fresh local products, like fish, meat, garden vegetables. But the country's food culture has been deeply impacted by its complicated history. What is actually Estonian food? We are very much uh, German in our food culture, but at the same time, we have a lot of Soviet heritage. There is a lot of influence by all kinds of different intruders who came here in order to get a better position at the scene. But at the same time, I feel like at the moment we are establishing something new, something which is totally unique for Estonia. Estonia's new wave of restaurateurs are experimenting and elevating native specialties. The country joined the Michelin Guide in 2022. Come with me to visit one of the restaurants that's pushing boundaries in Tallinn. Lay Restaurant in Tallinn's Old Town has found a unique formula. They're reimagining an age-old Estonian communal dining experience. Le itself is actually one of the oldest uh, words in Estonian. It describes the old fireplace well. The, uh, in the old times, people were gathering to have their meals together, to have their laughs together. We want to bring this old joy of sharing the food around our tables. Christian Peaska is the co-owner of Le and a trained sommelier. He's giving hyper-local Estonian products an international twist with the help of Canadian head chef Hiro Takeda. Here is our head chef and he's the mastermind behind actually combining Estonian ingredients together with his well-traveled experience. Yeah, and I think uh, the menu here is uh, primarily based on uh, more than anything like my discovery of Estonia, of coming here a few years ago and uh, being able to discover some of the history and the culture of this place. Uh, and then through that, be able to navigate uh, sort of my own personal travels and my own upbringing as well uh, into creating a menu that uh, hopefully brings uh, some surprises to our guests. Hiro showed us three of his latest dishes, a seasonal asparagus tart, sashimi made from local trout, and his own creative take on a classic Estonian curd snack called kohuke. The combinations are surprising, both familiar and brand new. Uh, I really cherish that too. we as people have to develop throughout times. And in our restaurants, we we'll constantly actually think about, uh, you know, what brought us here might not be something that carries us forward. So I would say change really for us is the key word within this business. And where did your passion come from? That actually really comes from my home. So if you feel like it, I'm actually happy to show you. Christian grew up in the countryside, around 100 kilometers from Tallinn. His parents run a little B&B in the picturesque village of Vaikelatro, surrounded by forest and nature. So welcome. Here's my mother, Helle, and my father, Endel. Hi, so nice to meet you all. So nice Hello, to meet Helle. you. Tere, Anka. Helle, nice to meet you. Tere, Anka, thank you so much for having me in your home. Is there anything I can do to help with uh, this meal? Sakul, kasvohne san sipulat ja tilli ja peenre san piparmenti. Okay, all right, let's do it. Back when Estonia was under Soviet occupation, many families, like Christians, grew their own food. Today, they still grow tomatoes and fresh herbs in their greenhouse. Hele is making us some traditional Estonian comfort food. Hele, can you tell me about what dish we're making today? Ja Kristjani lapsed armastavad ka väga. Kõige peal pruunistan liha ära, siis panen sibule, siis jahu ja piima ja vett. Ja keema ja ongi korras. Ta on väga tänulik, et ta saab osaleda ja ta on väga elevil toidu pärast, mida ta proovida saab. Aitäh. Aitäh. Estonia has been filled with the most amazing discoveries, incredible nature, unique culture, delicious food. But what really makes this country worth visiting is its people and the warm welcome that everyone has given me since I've been here. I hope you enjoyed meeting them as much as I have. And until next time, thanks for watching Discover Estonia.